Hey guys, welcome back to Factorio. Brave New World, I am Eddie Man, and this is episode number three. The last episode, we went ahead and got our little bit of iron supply up and running, and also with transport belt uh, production. Uh, this episode, we're going to go ahead and get um, some copper production copper plates online, and possibly get green circuits online um, and then what I want to do is I really need to gear for science and get uh, automation going uh, so that is also one of my goals for this episode uh, so let's go ahead and get cracking with this went ahead in between episodes and just did a few little minor things there was a bunch of rock piles here I got rid of them because uh, they're gonna be in the way here in just a moment. So what we're going to do here is we are just going to place that right about there. Okay. And then again Look at our power poles. We are kind of running low, but we need to run power up there as well. So let's go ahead and give the bots some work to do. Okay. With this uh, bio and terrain, it's hard to see the power pole uh, powered um, radius. <clears throat> All right, we'll go ahead and place a light over here by this fuel port. Now, we don't have access to build any lights, but we did start with 10 of them. So I'm going to utilize those by the rubble ports for now. Okay. The coal is good. Uh, we might have to pick up these two miners for our copper production that's coming right up. Oh, power. What happened? Oh, we ran out of coal. Because the bots are busy doing other things, that's why. Okay, so they're like a steady supply of coal. <laughs> yep, they most definitely are. What I'm gonna have to do is I'm gonna have to stop this now that I have um, transport belt production, I can run um, transport belts up. Can we make brown mana drills? Uh, yeah, but they take stone furnaces to make. Okay, well, we can make a bunch of stone furnaces. What I'm going to want to do is, oh, I can't make a coal flower because I need a chest to alright shoot All right, we're gonna need to run coal up to power and it looks like we're just gonna have to run it right through the oil fields right now Okay, that's well. That won't be a problem. So let's just run this up across as far as much as we can, and then I think I want to go up this.
like so. Give me the belts there. Two stone furnaces. We're gonna have to make some stone furnaces. And we might as well get that going. We have we have one requested chest left. Why don't we only have one? Oh, I know why. This here, we need to get rid of this. <clears throat> as soon as the coal starts flowing. I really should change that to a burner miner. Inserter. Burn a minor inserter. All this color just gotta get it to power. We are going to make stone furnaces here, and you are going to request 60 stone. Next five. Oh, not 60. 10. Okay, we'll get rid of that because we don't need that anymore. Okay. So we got plenty of transport belts now to last us a little bit. And the coal is backing up there. Perfect. Okay. And we're making stone furnaces. Okay. Give a logistic spot some other type of work to do. Is there any trees nearby? I need to start collecting trees. 
Okay, let's see what's in the, the vicinity of these rubble ports here. Just some more rocks. The trees. Okay. Well, do we have a forest anywhere close by here? We got some trees down there. Okay, then trees are going to be a problem then. For wood, for power, for wooden power poles. <clears throat> all right so this looks good it's using up all the iron which is might be an issue Power is good, we are in the green. I might have to double up on that soon, so I might have to make a boiler. Which is what, four pipes and one. So we have four pipes and 17 pipes. I can't even transfer. Items from there to there. That the bot's doing it. Okay. I see. Getting way off tra track here. Let's go ahead then and let's build that copper because we're going to need that ASAP. Okay. I don't think we're gonna need this anymore. At least not for a while. Now, does the bot pick up the... Yes, it does. Okay. Whew. Then we can get rid of that. Where one, two, 
one storage bin left. But we have some pests that provide us. So let's just go like that and then get a passive provider here. I think we can do that as well. That'll put iron into here. Uh, we're gonna need a lot, so let's do six. Let the iron build up. Okay. Uh, we only need one copper right now, right? So let's just do one instead of two. You up. Stop you. Just want one oil burner. Well, we just want one boiler. I meant to say. Okay. So now that's good. good let's finally get coal going and I call copper okay so we'll go over here and we will place down one copper mine with a request the chest okay and then We want a passive provider, which we are in logistics zone, okay. Right next to it. We are gonna just put a burner on oh, a boy a uh, stone furnace there with a inserter in, inserter out. Okay, and then we're gonna request some just like that. <clears throat> We're gonna smelt some copper here so we can at least get some research going, hopefully this episode. Okay. Do you wanna make sure I have I don't have another request a chest. I have one here. Okay, so you can make my packs for me. Uh, let's have you request 20 iron gears, which should be it, which should have been made down here, right? We have another. I do. I have three more assembling machines. Okay. Right. Sorry about that. Let's put this back with this. And this. We're going to make the iron gear wheels there. And then we're going to bring the iron gear wheels here to make science pack one.
of stone. Oh, we have copper plates being made. Look at that. Excellent. Okay, we're going to make the red science packs. And then we can dump them into here. And then what we can do is then the labs be like this, right? Just to get some research going. Gear wheels all the way down here. Oh, I never said it, that's why. Okay, the iron gear wheels are on their way. Perfect. We have a boiler here. Where are you going with my gears? you working it has something in its hand it has a stone furnace in its hand I'm so confused <laughs> and we have red science packs being made perfect um, automation optics Automation requires all the other science packs as well. Science pack one or science, science pack two, early science, science three, defense. Oh my goodness. Okay. The question is how do we make those? One, two, three. One, this unlocks two, what unlocks three, military? Carrots unlocks three. Okay. So I just have to make science pack one then to unlock optics. Oh, iron ore and copper ore. Okay. And these, this is a requester chest. And then, is this a requester chest? It is. So then here, all I have to do then is no, we want to do it here. 
question as to why I have ruin. Yes, I do. Perfect. We also want to request... Kind of each or. And that's going to make uh, five science, one or science. Science pack one, science one. <laughs> science one requires two iron ore and two copper ore, and we get five beakers. That's going to be major confusing. <laughs> but as we um, as we tech up and we get our base bigger, then um, it shouldn't be that bad. I just totally forgot that <laughs> utilizing the 30 new science packs. So I'm like, why can't I do automation? Hello. Waiting for those ores to come. The bots are so busy picking up. Oh, they can't pick up out of from a requester. They can only drop off, right? Oh, so that's gonna be the problem then. That's going to be a problem. I only have one provider left and no storage, one storage bin. Uh, oh shoot. So I'm going to have to start get it, gearing up and order meeting things. Uh, so I can stop relying on the bots because the bot tech I won't be able to build for a little while. But I am way over time for this episode. So I'm going to go ahead and pan over here to copper. Which is puny a little bit. <laughs> but uh, unfortunately I am out of time. So I'm going to go ahead and wrap up this episode here. I want to thank you guys so much for joining me in this episode of Factorio Brave New World. Um, if you haven't yet, please go ahead and consider throwing this video a like. It greatly helps out me and the channel. And if you want to stay up with everything Eddie Man and continuing with this series, wonderful Brave New World RTS-like style uh, scenario for Factorio, please go ahead and also s consider subscribing to the channel as well. But right now, I want to thank you so much for joining me in this episode of Factorio. And like always, I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.